Well, Christmas is almost here, and I know we're going to be eating all these very unhealthy things, you know. Um, as you can see behind me, I've got my bread sitting there that I love very much. But anyway, um, I'm going to try to make us a little healthy salad that we can have as a side, and this is a grilled strawberry salad. Come on in my kitchen, and let's get started on this wonderful salad. So what I have here is two heads of romaine and then I've got some strawberries. I've already washed them and now I'm going to chop them up and then we're going to grill our lettuce. So stay tuned. Okay, we got my strawberries in here. I'm going to save those for last. That's for the top. And then this is my salad here, but I'm going to use an olive oil sprayer so I don't put as much olive oil and I'm going to coat them just a little bit my lettuce with olive oil and move that around kind of get my hands in here oops a little bit of that there and then I'm also going to use something a little bit different than probably you would think I'm going to use a little bit of blackened seasoning and that's blackened seasoning now if you don't like that you can use salt and pepper or whatever but I just want to be a little bit seasoned different and I'm going to do this before I go throw it on the grill then I may come back and put a little bit more if I don't have enough on there, but we're going to move on now to the grill. Okay, I have a black stone here, but you can do it any, any way on the grill or stove top. Even if you want to grill it whole, you can. But what I'm going to do here is just toss them around. Now, this does not take long at all. Does not take long at all. Probably less than a minute or two that we're going to get this. You don't want to get it too done and too limp, but you want to get a little bit of that grill taste. If you don't have a black stone, it's been one of my favorite things um, that I've used and bought so far. It's kind of my Christmas present to myself, I guess you'd say, and I have loved it. I got it back a little bit before Thanksgiving, and I have loved, loved, loved it. So one of the things at Christmas with my family, we always got together, my brother and sister, and my mom always made stuff from the farm. This was not one of them. We usually had iceberg lettuce. I am not an iceberg lettuce fan. I know a lot of people like it, but I love more of your hearty lettuces. To me, iceberg just doesn't have a lot of flavor. But um, on the farm, that's what we normally had was iceberg lettuce, and then we had all the stuff, the vegetables, the peas, and the corn. My mom makes the best cream corn. I'll have to make that recipe for you one day, but it had to be a healthier version, version because everything that we did, of course, was not always healthy. A lot of butter and a lot of mayonnaise and a lot of other things were involved in our, um, in our um, eating every day. We lived off the farm a lot. Anyway, as you can see, our lettuce here is getting a little bit wilted. It's almost ready to be going and going back in the pan and fix, finishing up. But um, it doesn't take very long as long as you see it start wilting a little bit. And we'll be finished up with this very shortly. It already smells good. I like the smell of lettuce like this. It's really, really good. All right. This is done. I'm going to put it back in the pan here that I took it out of. We go there. My cat's jumping on the chair there, so sorry if you see a little jiggly wiggly going on. All right, this is done. So I'm going to put this on the on the back in the pan here, and we'll finish this up, and I'll be back with you. Okay, so here's our product here. But what I've done is, let me come around this way. What I've done, as you can see, I've added the strawberries around in the circle. I actually added some ed edamame beans on the top, which are very good in the salad. And then I got a few walnuts around the edges, right? All right, I'm going to put a little bit of balsamic vinaigrette because that's what I like. But you can choose whatever you want and kind of cover that with that. But what the final touch is going to be is I'm going to use... A balsamic glaze that's going to be my final touch 
and we're going to kind of circle that around make it look real pretty this balsamic glaze so look at this this is a very very delicious salad you're going to love it so this is your grilled strawberry salad with walnuts and edamame i hope you enjoy and have a very happy christmas merry christmas to everyone see you next time well this is my son grandson brooks remember you saw him when he was younger he and i like to eat crackers together so you want to eat your cracker with me hmm come on there we go you're a good boy i love this little boy this is first christmas again everybody i hope you have a good time with your family love you all see you soon mm -hmm.